Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. I just wanted to pop on with a quick video because we are super excited to announce the launch of our brand new side door integration. Now this new integration is going to allow you to unlock the entire side door product library directly within Design Files. And that will make it quick and easy for you to create beautiful designs like this using hundreds of thousands of products from top trade brands You'll also be able to instantly generate shoppable collections for any of the design boards that you create, and you'll be able to earn an average of 30% commission on every order. Plus, when an order is actually placed, that's it, you're done. Side door takes care of the rest for you. So in this video, I thought I would just jump in and show you how you can sync your Design Files account with your Side Door account so that you can create shoppable designs like this that you can earn high commissions on without actually having to manage the product orders. Now there's two ways that you can go ahead and sync your Design Files account with your Side Door account. For one, you can just pop into your account settings up here and you'll see the new Side Door Sync option or you can choose to go directly into the mood board software. And if you go into the mood board software, you're just gonna pop over to the products panel and click into the vendors tab. You're gonna scroll down through the vendors list and you're gonna see the new option for side door. Just click on that. Now that's gonna open up this panel right here. And this panel is just basically giving you an overview for what's included with this integration. And if you wanna learn more, you could just click this button. If you already have a side door account, or if you want to just create a free side door account to use this integration, you can click this button. That's going to pop you over into your account settings. And what you need to do is just click this button right here to pop over to side door. If you already have a side door account, you'll click the login link. You're going to log into your account and you'll see an option that basically asks you to authenticate the connection. If you don't have a side door account, you're just going to click this button, pop over to side door. And what you'll do is you'll click on the link to create your side door account. Once you've finished creating your side door account, you'll see that option where you can choose to authenticate the connection. When you do that, you'll be brought right back to this view and you'll see this green message at the top, basically saying that you have successfully, uh, <laughs> successfully connected your side door account with your design files account. Once you've done that, you can pop over to your projects and you can start building out design boards by accessing the entire side door product library. So let's go ahead. We're going to jump into this design here that I've already created, and we're just going to edit this design so we can go back into the mood board software. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on the vendors tab here. I'm going to scroll down to the side door option. And now you'll see that you've got full access to all the products. So you can actually choose to browse the entire side door product library in a few different ways. You can search by keyword if you want, um, or you can actually choose to search by price or by brand. If you search by brand here using the brand filter, you'll see all of the trade brands that are available in this product feed. And when you click on any of them, it'll just show you that brand's collection. And then you can just drag these products out onto your design board and start building out your design. When you're ready, just go ahead and save your design. And once the design is saved, I'll show you how you can create your shoppable collection for this board. Okay, perfect. So let's go ahead. We're gonna, we've saved the design. We're gonna jump back to the project. So here we can see the design board that I just created. If I scroll down, I'll see the full product list, including every single item I added to this design. And just above my product list, you're gonna see this new band here. And this band is basically saying, hey, you've got 23 side door products that were used in this design. Do you wanna create a collection? So I'm gonna go ahead and just click the button here to create my collection. We'll call this, you just gotta give your collection a name. So I'm just gonna call it sample collection. And here you can choose to either make your collection public or private. If you like the idea of your client being able to just come in and click on any of these shop buttons and pop over to that shoppable collection on side door to purchase the products, then leave your collection as public. If you prefer to not let your client do that and you want to place the order on behalf of them, you can switch your collection to private. I'm going to leave it as public for now and we'll go ahead and create this collection. All right, my collection is created. You don't have to do any extra steps and pull the, all these products together on your side door account. It's just automatically gonna generate that collection for every item that you used within this design board that is a side door product. 
At that point, you can literally just click the button to submit the designs to your client. And when they come in, they'll be able to review the designs and they can come down to the product list where they can approve items, decline items, they can leave feedback on items, and they can click through on any of these shop bu buttons and they'll be taken right over to the shoppable collection on side door where they can start adding these items to cart. Plus, if you have created a, des a design board that includes multiple side door products, your client will also see this link right here where they can see all the products in this collection. If they click this link, they'll act to this collection and they'll be able to just automatically start adding all of these items to cart and check everything out in one seamless process. So it's so much more convenient for your clients, especially if you've already been creating shoppable design boards and you've got a few products from one brand and a few products from another brand and a few products from another brand, your client has to go to each and every one of those online locations to place the orders. Here, they could just check out everything all at once and be done in one step. Now I am gonna jump back to my Design Files account because there are a few other options that I just wanna make sure you're aware of. So if you do create a side door collection for any of your designs, you'll see this new button show up on your product list. And if you click into that, here are the options you have. If you did choose to create your uh, collection as a private collection, you can actually check out as a designer. So if you wanna place the order on behalf of your client, you're just gonna come in here, you're gonna click the option to check out as a designer, and that's gonna bring you straight to the cart view for this design. All the items have already been added to cart, and now you can just immediately move forward with placing the order. Also, if I come back to my Design Files account, we go back into this menu, you'll see that you can view the collection on your side door account as well. The cool thing about this is that if I pop over and view this collection, I'll be able to see the potential profit I can make from this particular design board. And if I wanna see the individual breakdown, I can just scroll through the product list and I'll see the designer price, the retail price, and the profit that I can make on each of these items. Now, if you've already been allowing your client to just shop products without you earning on all of your recommendations, or if you've been using standard affiliate links like Share a Sale, Commission Junction, or Like to Know, you'll know that on average, you typically only earn about two to 7% off of those standard affiliate links. Here you can earn up to an average of 30% on all of these products. So if you're already creating these shoppable designs, this is a great way for you to really start boosting the income that you can make from all of these projects. Now, last but not least, I'll just pop back over here. You also have options where you can edit your collection and you can delete your collection at any time if you want to. But on a whole, this is a great way where you can start accessing hundreds of thousands of trade products. You'll be able to create shoppable links for any of the design boards that you create, or sorry, shoppable collections for any of the design boards that you create. You can let your client shop the look. You can earn an average of 30% on all of the orders. And you don't just have to use this for client projects. You could also choose to use this to create shoppable content that you can share online. You could create trend boards or top 10 lists or uh, collection boards that you can share with your following and start earning from that as well. If you've built up an image as an influencer over the years, it's a great way to take advantage of that image and then start earning from that as well. So there you have it. This is the brand new side door uh, integration that we've built into Design Files. We're really excited to be teaming up with them. I think it's gonna give you a lot of great new options for your business and different ways that you can monetize off of your designs. So jump into your Design Files account, give this new feature a try, and as always, let us know what you think. Thanks for watching.